Before coming here to Ukraine, I was a staff member of several summer camps and also self-development workshops. Yeah? And in all the conflicts between people, I realized that the main issue is always the same. The essence of the problem is one of the two fellas. They don't want to recognize their mistake. So this is how we're going to work. We are going to share our experiences, how we resolve conflict in both cases uh, between in two people and other groups. So, come on, come on. I will give you chocolate after this. So let's take the next example. Yoshiharu never cleans the bathroom after using it. He doesn't even put the air freshener. Then Don Chan gets inside and starts to suffer the consequences. He could endure it for one week, but his level of stress and anger were increasing more and more, day by day, until finally he just... <coughs> he just exploded. Hey you! Why didn't you flash it away? Peek. Peek? I think I know the answer. Go ahead. They need a mediator. A mediator. These two guys, they are in such high emotional tension that just a normal dialogue or a calm give and take, there is no space. That is why a third one, a third one will help a lot to cut that down. Very important thing to be a good mediator is that you have to be impartial, cold-minded, big ears. You feel me? So, that's enough for today. Have a great day and please behave well. What about you? How do you think about it? Do we need the mediators? How do you solve the conflict in your house? Let us know in the comment. And I promise with you to give chocolate. Psych. Thank you so much for watching for this video. I hope it will help you to solve future conflicts. Don't forget the like button and subscribe. <laughs> See you next time. Mission change. Hey, Peek. <laughs> <laughs>